Arsenal boss Mikel Arteta has been warned not to punish Mateo Gendutzi too severely after last week's antics against Brighton. Arsenal midfielder Matteo Gendutzi shouldn't be punished too harshly for his actions against Brighton after being left out of Mikel Arteta's side to face Sheffield United on Sunday. That's the opinion of former Liverpool player Jamie Redknapp, who believes Gendutzi was acting in the heat of the moment and probably regrets his actions. Gendutzi faces an uncertain future at Arsenal after arguing with Gunners officials. The French midfielder is regarded as one of the brightest prospects in Europe after breaking into the Arsenal team under an Emery. But he had a controversial moment against Brighton last weekend as he clashed with Brighton forward Neil Morpé in the Gunners' 2-1 defeat. Reports suggest he had mocked Brighton players over their pay compared to his, before he got into a physical altercation with the Frenchman. Gendutzi was then reprimanded by RT2 after the game and dropped for the Gunners' trip to Southampton. The Frenchman is believed to have then held a meeting with Arsenal Chiefs and demanded a transfer, which was immediately rejected. Peter then kept Gendutzi out of his team for Sunday's FA Cup tie against the Blades, leading to further speculation over his future. But writing in his Daily Mail column, Redknapp insisted he shouldn't be too badly punished, as most players will have said similar things on the pitch. Redknapp said, Matteo Gendutzi did not make the Arsenal squad again yesterday, but I refuse to hammer the 21-year-old for his trash talking against Brighton. He apparently brought up money with Neil Morpé. It's crass, it's unkind, but it happens. It's happened since day dot in football and it will always happen. I've made comments, too, who are you? Turn around and show me your name because I've not got a clue who you are. It's all said in the heat of the moment. A player says something he later regrets, so to slaughter Gendutzi for sledging, to borrow the cricket term, is unfair. He is not the first to do it, he won't be the last. I'd rather focus on his performances, if you want to act like a big player, play like one. Let's hope being dropped by Mikel Arteta comes as a reality check and he learns from it, 